Hey, it's a funny face to me on three. One, two, three, go. Alex is actually our director, and him and his wife are always just not mushing, mending. They're like, they're like, like a machine with with the cogs, but one of the cogs is is sunk in bourbon, and the other one's a bitch. Uh, hi, Alex. Yeah. So you're the director of Star Explorers. Um... Yep. Go ahead. Go on. Um, yes, I've been working with Alex. He is an interesting character. He's very, very outspoken. Everyone in the cast seems to get along fine, you know, except for the director and his uh, wife. Oh, can you tell us more about that? Um, no, you walk in, say rehearsal, and usually it's Alex ducking after she's thrown something at his head. I wrote all of it. Everything that we came up with. Here. Oh, Let me talk. I can interrupt you, you can't interrupt me. Because I'm the director. I am a genius. You may talk. Was he the one that smelled really badly of bourbon and scotch? Um, so you've been the director since the beginning. You helped co-wrote the, co the show. Yep, that was me. I only saw him from the back because he was leaning down a lot. I don't know, he was complaining about a stomach ache or a headache. I don't know, it just smelled really bad. He was making a lot of angry sounds like a bear was choking and it was very disturbing to hear. It's haunted my nightmares. I gotta go and I gotta, I gotta take a poop, like, really badly. And if I don't find a, a sink, I'm gonna probably poop in a costume. I mean, like, that's... Oh, I can really do. Um, by chance, uh, have you been able to get to know any of your cast members yet? Uh, not yet, but they'll be so excited to meet me, Courtney Valentine. I hear that um, you had a female understudy. Yeah, How I did. I hear you had a female understudy. Uh, however, you have recast the lead role at the last minute. Is there any reason for that? Yeah, the new chick's boobs are better. Straight up. Like. I actually got it yesterday. And when I got it, I was actually at Starbucks, hitting it up with the barista. But, you know, some things are more important than coffee, I guess. Who's <laughs> Gavin? Uh, he's the he's the actually the the prop hand for the show, oh, okay. so he's behind the scenes. Why are you attached to Star Explorers? Well, I'm not really attached. I'm attached to the theater. Like I work for this theater. Like that's that's why I'm here, right? I'm, it's, it's, I'm not part of them. I'm part of the theater. Like I've been working here for five years. Like that's that's really why I'm here. Everyone seems to know Gavin. What is it about Gavin that draws everyone in? I don't know. Frankly, I find the guy kind of scary. Um, to take personal time, that hinders a cast and a crew. Uh, were you guys given vacation pay, time leave, anything like that? Vacation pay. No, I work differently than you do. You do realize this is going live on the news. Hi. Um, I don't. Well, I don't really. I don't really kiss and tell. But I can. I can tell you. There's definitely. There's somebody I may be interested in. Just a little bit. Is it something we might be able to see on stage? Um, possibly. You want to go first? Uh. Oh, this is Eve. Eve, hi Eve. So what character do you play in Star Explorers? Well, she actually plays a, a character named Duthry. Uh, she's the co-owner of a space bar and she's got uh, all of the major songs that we have in our show. It's like all the ones that the kids are singing out on the street. Yeah. The, the ship is a comparatively small role. The ship is a very, very small role. And um, frankly, I, I don't think I can play any more uh, lead roles or anything like that. I mean, not since the accident. Well, I'm not supposed to say this, but 
you ask me again? You know, the ship sort of has a personality. Or... Mostly it's just going like... That's basically what I do. You make the sounds yourself? Successful? Well... That's what it's like. Can you just sum up Star Explorers in three sentences or less? Three sentences or less. Hmm. Exploring space and saving the planets. Adventure. An amazing original sci-fi musical. Love. There's stars and people. Space? Star explorers who explore the stars. Yep, that's that's about it. Space. Lightsaber. And so I came down, but I... Stage manager? Why should people come to see your show? Because I fucking wrote it. I'm great. People need to, people need to see the work of Alex I'm Courtney Valentine, are you kidding me? People would love to line up for hours just to get a look, a glimpse at me. <laughs> Great, you can go now. <laughs> uh, well, uh, like I said, I just graduated college. I was in for backstage theater and stuff like that. I didn't really stage manage. I was more of a uh, lighting and stuff like that, but uh, yeah, no, I, I, I could help with stage managing. Yeah, I can do it. Would you be able to explain Star Explorers in one word or less? Space. Right? Yeah, space. <sighs> okay. uh, all right, let's go. Wait, what? Are we done? Are we done? Are we done shooting with me? Guys? Hello? Nobody. Nobody? Everyone left? Hello? Show. This cast is the worst people ever. This is my interview. I hate them all. They don't even remember my fucking name. Stupid pieces of shit. Gavin? Yeah. Uh, who's this? Oh, this is uh, Michael. Michael Free. Hello. Um. So Jamie, you're brand new, you may be unaware of this, but rumors are floating that one of the cast and or crew members has a criminal record. Were you aware of this when you applied? No. That's news to me. Oh my God, are you sure that's correct? Absolutely not. I mean, Courtney Valentine does not associate herself with criminals. Oh my God. I don't know anything about that. I certainly didn't help him. I mean, I didn't. What? What was the question? I try to get along with everybody. Um, there are some really great guys in the show, and you know, we, we joke around a lot, and uh, sometimes they don't get it, but we don't all have the same sense of humor. We can't. Um, but so I'm, I'm pretty much... Pretty much just focusing on me, doing me, as Drake would say. Uh, yeah, no, no really prospects there. Her name's Lil, Lil, Lol, Lolly, Lol, uh, Lil, Lilith, Lilith, her name's Lilith. Okay. Um, she's a great girl. Uh, I don't think there's a thing going on between them, but I definitely, I, I feel an attraction on Gavin's side. Juliana, wait, no, I, what the fuck is her name? Uh, Judy. Lolly. Lillian. Uh, l Lucy? L-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-l-
anything of, of, of notice, importance, not really. Lilith? They said, they said Lilith? Lilith. I don't know who told you that, but it, I just don't, I mean, he's a fucking weirdo, so. Yeah. Lilith is a fucking weirdo. <laughs> Why would I have anything to do with her? That's, I don't know. I don't know. It's not like he's, you know, strong from lifting all those props or anything, or that, like, the black looks really good on him. She's, like, out there. I would never even consider it. So if something does happen and it just kind of, you know, like like a Danny line in the cracks of the sidewalk, you know, where it shouldn't be there. So if something unexpected happens between, not you necessarily, but between anybody, I believe it should be because it happens, not because I'm going and like I'm bored and I want to go talk to Gavin. Um, yeah, I've got a lot of running around to do. I don't have time to sit around and talk. Works very hard. Yep. I've noticed you guys are dressed really nicely. Is this your costumes? Because you guys look really nice today, especially together. Yeah, uh, to get together. We, we look nice. I just, you know, I, I guess blue. it does. Yeah, it's both blue. We match matches. So we, we match. We match. Yeah. But yeah, no, for relationships, I really don't think that there's anything really wrong. Mm. Excuse me. Remember that time I saw you naked? Really? <sighs> it's just a one time thing. Why should audiences come to see Star Explorers? It's, un uh, it, it's a unique thing, and if people like space and the action and stuff like that, it's a new thing. It's not like a Sweeney Todd, it's not Annie, it's something completely new. Okay, good to know. It's, am I, am yeah, I you're, done? Do, you're done, that's I great. need to... Yeah, you're gonna have to get to work, okay?